Hi there YouTubers or sharers or whatever you want to be called today. Anyway, we're here to make some laundry detergent. This is laundry soap. My wife uses it all the time. We stop buying all that tight stuff and uh, I mean it's probably good but we just choose not to use it. We like soaps that are not just easy on our clothes but easy on us because it touches our skin and this is like really good for you it's even edible but I wouldn't taste it I wouldn't even need it but apparently so we're comfortable that if the dogs or the grandkids are got into this it wouldn't be an issue so this here pink solution that we get we buy ours at Costco it's made in British Columbia and it comes to our Costco twice a year so we have to always like go there every week just to make sure we don't miss out but it comes with this sheet of paper and I'm pretty sure you can find this online um, you don't have to have this copy there's probably a PDF online somewhere and if I find the link I'll post it below okay so what we're gonna do right now is we're only gonna deal with the full strength that's our dog see our dog wants all the attention she always does this it's like she's trying to make us do her bidding so there's three different strengths right and if you print this here get this online you're gonna see you got your full strength your um, heavy mix and your light mix right and what we're gonna make is heavy mix and for ease of learning here my wife's already calculated out what we need for this particular size bottle and the reason we like this bottle is it's got this nice little pour spout which means we can put this above our washing machine we have a cover we put it above that and then it's really easy to use the way the instructions are is we're going to scoop up some of this stuff it's almost like a paste and we're going to heat it up in the microwave make it into a liquid and then we're going to add hot water to this so this makes quite a bit it makes about four liters or one gallon okay so this stuff's really cool we wash everything like we wash our floors with it we can wash our we use it even to clean our hot tub we can clean our dog with it we can um, we can do so many things so you can use this on uh, like carpets rugs and upholstery we can use it in steam cleaners like we have a nice steam cleaner downstairs we don't buy the soaps anymore we just make our own so we use that for cleaning the carpet uh, we can clean all the interior of our vehicle it gets bugs off the windshield really nice we clean the outside of the RV with this stuff and the inside and uh, oh, it says here you can do uh, hot tub filters but you'll see a video I made for cleaning hot tub filters and uh, pool filters I don't use any soaps at all because I don't want soap in my hot tub and you can clean lawnmowers your shoes jewelry and your fruits and vegetables boy that's pretty useful stuff I'm gonna take this paper put it away so I don't get it messed up okay so I got my extra container this is gonna go in the microwave oven I got it she's already done the math we're gonna do two-thirds of a cup so I'm just gonna scoop up two-thirds okay and that's there's one-third I'm gonna put it in here and then another third pushing it hard against the side so I can get a nice even edge okay and this isn't rocket science so and there we go and then I have my spatula I'm just going to get that all in here now really super simple we're gonna take this and we're gonna throw it in the microwave oven I'm gonna use one minute to start with and then uh, we'll see how it works but what's going to happen is the microwaves don't heat things the way you know on stove or an oven does so um, we're going to have to mix this up and it might take some time to to melt down so we have our solution i've just put the water on to boil it right and i've put two liters in there so what we're going to do is we're going to use that two liters while that's boiling we're going to put this in a microwave we'll put it one minute We'll see how it works. 
All right, so the water just finished boiling. We uh, preheated it, by the way. And no, no, oh, there's no magic to this. <laughs> okay, and here we are, one minute. And this, this is liquid. It's just got a little uh, white hard center. I'm just mixing it up, it's steaming away. And pretty soon it's gonna be totally liquid and it's almost there now. And there you go. Complete liquid. Okay, so this is all liquid now. We have our hot water. And I just wanna tell you how great a buy this is. We get this at Costco for $50 Canadian. And then it can make 40 of these, 40. Oh my God, huge savings. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mix this up right in front of you. Too easy to do. We have our funnel. Now I suppose there's people out there who are gonna to wanna to wear safety glasses and gloves and smocks and everything else. But uh, I don't know, anybody who's in a kitchen who cooks in the kitchen shouldn't have an issue with this. So we're just gonna pour this in here. And there we are. It's all in there. Now my wife's watching, she's gonna want me to use this tool to make sure I scrape all the outsides and everything, get it all in there. But what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put some water in this and uh, pour it in here anyway. So there we are. I just wanna say that this is the uh, heavy mix and we have another video coming up and we're gonna do the light mix. I'm just gonna pour some hot water in here. And the water is already turning blue from all the soap that's in here. It's a nice color. And I'm going to pour this into the funnel. And there we go. Okay. And we pour this whole thing in here. So that's two liters. Two liters of uh, boiling hot water mixed with the liquid soap, the pink solution soap. Okay, and then what we're going to do now is we're going to take this and we're going to top it up with the hot water right out of the tap. So I'm going to leave the water run for a while and I'll just top it up right out of the tap. Okay, so I've let the water run. It's really hot right now. I'm just gonna fill this up. This is uh, nowhere near as hot as the boiling water was. Ugh. So we have foam on top. It looks like we can get a lot more in here. Just need to slow it down. Yep, that's pretty good. It's pretty full. Yeah, once I put it down on the counter, it's uh, it's pretty full. So I'm just squishing down so I can get the foam out of here. Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay, so got our mix mixed. Our mix mixed. Okay, so then we're gonna take this and I'm just demonstrating the way it's used for us in the um, laundry room here. So. We have one of these high efficiency front load washers where we use half a cup of this soap. If you're using the top load and it tells you in the instructions, then you're gonna need a whole cup, All right? So just go like, squeeze the container and we're done. That's all we use. And this, this is gonna give you a lot of loads. Now, the extra stuff, we like to put it in a spray bottle and we label it heavy mix <clears throat> and we can use this on like our hot tub or our car or our RV or whatever. And we use it everywhere. Like even the dog gets this. Um, anyway, hope you loved this video. If you liked it, please hit like, subscribe and watch for our next video on how to do the light mix.